Yo, what is going on everybody? It is Tristan and today in this video, I thought this, uh, you know, could be helpful for some people, you know what I mean? This content we got right here today, we're gonna be discussing the Wu-Tang Dunk a little updated resale prediction along with how you may be able to cop. Since we got some raffles online for this pair, we got a sneakers drop on the way. Uh, the prices have got a lot more affordable. So yeah, some good things about the sneaker. And we'll get into it. Hopefully I'm sounding a bit better in this video. I've been kicking the sickness, so I'll probably be done with it tomorrow. Um, I mean, I, I'll, I doubt I'll still have it tomorrow. You know what I mean? I got that mindset like, I'm not gonna have it tomorrow, but you never know, you know what I mean? I'm just going into it like, no, I'm not gonna be, I'm not gonna be sick no way but yeah we'll see i'll start training again stuff like that tomorrow so hopefully i'll be feeling good and yeah we're just going to get into this video discussing the wu-tangs so hope y'all will enjoy again if you guys want more content like this feel free to subscribe and like down below the usual stuff we say just trying to 300 likes on this video let them know these are the types of videos y'all want more of and i'll make more content like this since i know it's been a while since we've done a how-to cop so let me know and make sure you guys check out the early pair review and the union ones yesterday those are dropping summer 2025 so you want to check that out make sure you do and of course that's at resale vision down below you can see some of the deals we did just last night we're giving away a pair of black cement threes right now that upcoming release so i mean again if you want a chance to win a free pair of sneakers right there and of course get the under market sneakers we do every single day other items like that as well it's a wide variety of things and yeah check it out that's all down below don't miss out and my Instagram's down there too. So if you want to check what I post for sale on my story, feel free to check it. I'll be posting stuff there probably right after this video. It's probably one of the first things I'll do. But yeah, I got a couple things to do today. I'm gonna make a brief trip to UPS just wherever, whatever I got arriving today. I got a lot arriving tomorrow. I don't know why UPS has been so slow lately, but yeah, I, at least I'll have a lot arriving tomorrow on Saturday so I can get it out to my members in Resale Vision. Shout out to everyone in there. Apologies for any delays. It's just, yeah, Black Friday has, has, you know, <laughs> shipping providers are very busy right now. But uh, starting the screen recording right here, you guys can see that should be up right now. I just wanted to, I was explaining myself a second ago, just give a brief explanation, you know, for anybody that might be waiting on something, you know, that's why. I just had stuff delayed by like two days, most things, because FedEx has gotten busier, so. Yeah. But looking at this, as you guys can see, the Wu-Tang Dunk High retail, 150 bucks, dropping on November 9th, 10 a.m. Eastern time. You guys can see one of the main things it says on the app is available at, so. Keep in mind, this is not gonna be a video draw. It's gonna be a video first come, first serve. So you're gonna wanna be right on the app when this releases. Now, it'll give you a minute or two, right? So you can enter a 10.01 or 10.02, but I really wouldn't re like recommend waiting as long as possible because keep in mind, this isn't a draw where you're gonna be able to check it at 11.07, 11.08 and still be able to enter for it. No, by then they'll be sold out or entries will be pending and you won't be able to enter you know, for it anymore. Whatever the process uh will be you know because sometimes some drops take a really really long time and they pen for like 20 minutes then we figure out the results or sometimes it's like right away so we'll have to see what kind of drop it'll end up being my guess is that it'll take a bit for them to give us results on these but it really does depend on stock numbers as well if this has like a decent amount of stock like 50 60 000 pairs then you know we'll probably get results fairly quickly because you know there'll be enough pairs to like get out to people but if there's like a really limited amount of pairs like let's say they do like 3500 or like 5000 pairs of these on sneakers then yeah it's probably going to take them a little bit for you know to give us results a lot of people will get their l's really quick but in terms of dubs you know it's going to take them a bit to decide like you know out of all the entries who's going to get the win if you know there's that you know, few amount of pairs i don't have any stock number predictions yet if i'm editing this video and get any information i'll try and uh you know put it on the screen but yeah i haven't seen anything yet i just the only thing we've seen the stock numbers for is the shock drop which is like 2500 pairs or something like that so if the stock if the shock drop was like 2500 pairs i think or something like that might have been less than that i don't know i might be thinking wrong I think it was about 2,500 globally though, amongst like all locations. But yeah, if we want to kind of like do the math, you know, there'll probably be about like 10 to 20,000 pairs on sneakers. That's my personal prediction. I could see these going up in price. I don't think they're going to make like a ton of them. I think they'll try and keep this one a little bit limited. And uh, I mainly, this, this prediction I'm basing off just like the shock drop. Because if the shock drop had like 2,000 pairs, the shock drop is usually like a fifth or a sixth or a fourth of the stock. So, I mean, I'm just times it by four or five, six. So it'll be like, you know, 8,000 to like, 12,000 or 20, I don't know. It's like some around there. That's my prediction. I think realistically we'll see not like a super limited amount, but not a ton. I think around like 20,000 would make sense. But we'll have them in a few days. They'll leak on Twitter. You guys will see that soon. But as you guys can see the size range we got going from men's 3.5 up to a men's 15. So, you know, any of my guys are a size 16, unfortunately. And got this one for you. But yeah, I, I don't know anybody with size 16. So yeah, we'll leave it at that. But I've had this pair in hand. You can go check out the earlier view. I mean, it's a pretty cool one. Uh, I mean, it was a somewhat early review, you know what I mean? They've been dropping this pair for like two months, you know what I mean? It's just been very, a very, very spread out release, you know what I mean? Hence why they've kind of been consistently dropping in price. And they'll stop dropping in price after the ninth because all the drops will be done. We got raffles, etc. Those will all be done by then. Or we might have a couple raffles, you know, left, but it's not going to affect the prices at that point because the main release will be done. The sneakers one, you know, where most of the stock is going to be dropping. So 
just keep that in mind. But yeah, the, the release has been kind of odd for this one. It kind of reminds me of the oxidized green forest where they were dropping for like a month or two, you know what I mean? It's just they started dropping in Europe a little bit earlier. But aside from that, some of the facts uh, and things like that we can mention about the shoe. Actually diving into the current resale prices, as you guys can see, the sales popularity has been going up. So if you just want to check out all right here, you guys can see. Uh, we have the light and bolt symbol. So more people have been going out the way and buying their pair. And I think that's smart, you know, because I don't think there's like a massive amount listed. Like if you go to size nine, right? You can see there's not like a huge amount of this pair, right? It's not like, oh my gosh, everyone has this sneaker, especially in the big sizes. Go to 11.5, you know what I mean? Like check out the asks. You see what I'm saying? Like it's not many till you even get the 400. Like that's like 10 or 10 or 15 asks until you get there. So that's not a lot of pairs. Like that could happen in a day. And look how spread out these sales are. Look, 235, 235, 236, 289. Like, I mean, the market literally moved up by 50 bucks just, you know, based off they're not, you know, being anybody else with 11.5 right now. But keep in mind, we do have a drop on the way. I personally think that these won't spike up in price a ton. But again, if we get the stock numbers, right, I'll say this, if we get the stock numbers and it only ends up being like 5,000, 10,000 pairs, those big sizes will quickly move to 350, 400. I think that will happen very, very fast. 11.5 plus, absolutely we predict to make some very, very quick progress. I mean, 13, obviously is gonna be one that stays up there just cause I don't know how many of those there are. You know what I mean? Like once you get the 13, 14, 15, like that's where you start getting to like, uh, not like single digit stock numbers, but you know, in the hundreds, like they rarely make thousands of pairs of those sizes, like for 14, 15, 13 sometimes is actually a really good stock pair. We could see that, but that's what I think for this pair. You know, it's a good one. I think the resale will be consistent. I could see him spike it up in price after a bunch of people take else and drop day. But if that does not end up being the case, there ends up being good stock. A lot of people take dubs. These would probably just stay about where they're at or go down 20, 30 bucks. So that's a personal prediction I got right now for these. And yeah, that's what I can say about the Wu-Tang Dunk High Reese sell and the sneakers release we talked about real quick. So let me end the screen recording wrong, uh, real quick, excuse me, because there's a couple other locations I want to discuss. Here's something I'm going to pop on the screen. Hopefully I've done that. Rafflesneakers.com. This is, again, shout out these guys. They've been they've been going at it for years. Years of consistency. I really respect it. But yeah, you can look up. This is not a promo, by the way, or anything. But yeah, I looked up um, the raffles for this release. You can see there's a couple that are live right now for the Wu-Tang Dunk. Not too many. Like there's the undefeated raffle and a couple other ones, but there's not many. You know, it's, it's fairly limited from what you can see. It's not like they just have a million raffles. At least last time I checked you know by the time you know I'm editing this video maybe there's been a bunch more raffles posted and that'll be a good thing if we see a lot of raffles that lets us know okay there'll be some decent backdoor for this pair so you know we can take our time and you know going out the way and pay paying resale right now but that'll also let us know like hey there's a decent chance for manual users so yeah we'll just have to see but we got raffles we got sneakers uh I don't know if there's any in-store locations at the moment but I would not be surprised if AB APB store on my money year you know did a little uh in-store drop for them so I would you know be checking their IG pages and maybe with your local one to see if they'll be doing that because they might be you never know they may have a raffle live right now and if that's the case then you know they may not do an in-store but you know they tend what i've noticed with uh, a lot of these in-store locations is whenever they tend to do it online they'll also tend to bring it in person maybe a week or two later and if it's not a week or two later they'll do it like a day or two later so just make sure you're always checking with your local you never know local apb on my money here uh if you got one you know if not check out those online raffles down below get ready for sneakers uh, and remember, more accounts, more chances. That's the key. But that's what I can say again. If you guys want more content like this, hopefully this video was helpful. Just let me know in the comments. And you guys can subscribe and like for more. Just trying to throw in your likes on this video. Just let's me know. Again, this is the type of video uh, y'all want more of. It's been a bit since we've done a how to cop. You know, I've been focusing more on sneaker leaks and early pair stuff and things like that. Because I've noticed that's what people want a little bit more. But if this is what you guys want more, maybe, you know, hey, let me know. Just Drop your thoughts in the comments. And more importantly, let me know if you're going to be copping the sneaker. I'm interested to hear that as well. So aside from, you know, me saying subscribe, like all that, I think I've, you know, just said that. So let me not repeat myself. I always do that every video. I don't know why I forget that I say that right at the start of my outro. But yeah, my IGs are down below. If you want to check me there, always buying, selling, trading on my story. So feel free to see what I got for sale there. I'll be making a website soon. But if you want to just check out anybody needs the Union Ones, Legend Blues, etc., just Check my story, lots for sale there. And yeah, feel free again uh, to check us out down below at Resale Vision. We're giving away a free pair, of our, free pair of black cements right now. I don't know why I couldn't say that, but yeah, if you want to check that out, some of the deals we do every day, things like that, make sure you guys check that out. And shout out all my members in there. We got tons of stuff going out tomorrow and Saturday. Apologies for any delays there. It's just Black Friday shipping delays. Hopefully understandable, I apologize. Americans like to buy stuff, so. I don't, yeah. <laughs> you, we, we, I know all of y'all have seen the Black Friday ads popping up, so that's the reason why. You know, I don't know why they y'all started promo on hella, hella early. Yeah, it happens. But that's it, guys. I'm Tristan. I will see you all in the next video tomorrow. And yeah, make sure you guys check out the Union Warm review yesterday. Don't miss out on that. But I'm more interested to hear, you know, what are your thoughts? You know, let me know how you're feeling about this pair. You copping, you're dropping. Do you like the prices? It's gotten a bit cheaper. 
I like that they've gotten cheaper. So I'm gonna see y'all in the next video tomorrow and catch you then. Hopefully I'll be feeling better. Should be. Peace.